Researchers have made a discovery that reveals new details about the history of life. This discovery was made right next to a major city. Uh, I never would have dreamt that this such an amazing discovery would have been found there. Thousands of exceptionally preserved animal and plant fossils have been unearthed in Colorado's Coral Bluffs, about 75 miles south of Denver. They are from the million years after an asteroid hit Earth and killed the dinosaurs, a little known time period. I think the, the biggest thing that we learned was just um, how a whole ecosystem recovers. These difficult to find fossils help break open some mysteries on how mammals evolved after the dinosaurs disappeared. One of the remarkable things is how resilient life is if you leave it alone. So after this mass extinction happened, um, life rebounded pretty quickly. I mean, we had things uh, we had a pretty diverse ecosystem around 100,000 years after the mass extinction. Paleontologists generally search for bone fragments when looking for fossils, but Tyler Lyson and his colleagues decided to search for egg-shaped rocks called concretions. Inside, they found rare mammal skulls like a raccoon-sized loxolophus. Uh, this animal is about the same size as the mammals from before the extinction. The rare findings, published in the journal Science, are also part of a documentary and a museum exhibit. It. The trove includes fossils from at least 16 mammal species and 233 plant species. A scientist who's not part of the discovery says that helps fill in some important gaps. We've known about the events leading up to this mass extinction reasonably well over the past couple of decades. This really um, fills out the important part of what happened afterwards and whether it was different or, or just continuation of the same. Um, and this tells us it's a little bit of both. Researchers believe the discovery may also help predict what will happen if global warming leads to another mass extinction. Right now, so I think it's important to understand how long it takes an ecosystem to bounce back after such a mass extinction event. And our data set you know, brings to bear uh, a lot of the answers to those questions. Answers, millions of years in the making. Carrie Antelfinger, Associated Press.